We're here with junior, junior midfielder Amanda Tarpley of Concordia University, Texas women's soccer team. And Amanda, last year the team had a breakthrough season by winning a school record 10 games, which doubled the previous total set in 2009, and qualified for the ASC tournament for the first time in program history before falling short in a shootout against UT Dallas. What were the key factors that led to the successful season the team had last year? Um, we had really great team chemistry, which I think was um, a big factor in that. We also, all of us worked really hard. We worked hard together, and we had a fire to prove people wrong. One big turning point was the UMHB game where um, they nobody expected us to win. They were big rivals, and we came through, and we won, and we just really had the urge to prove everybody wrong. Okay, and talk about how the off season went. What are some things that everyone has been working on so that the 2011 season can be even better? Um, we continue to work on that team chemistry every day because that's a big part. We're a team sport. Nobody can do anything by themselves. We all have to work together. And um, just fitness, that's the biggest thing in soccer. You know, you run up and down the field a lot. So that, those have been big. Uh, you've been selected by your coaches and peers to serve as a co-captain this fall, even though you're only entering your second season as a member of the squad. What are your thoughts about being elected to serve as captain and so, so soon? Um, that's a huge honor. I mean, um, to be elected by your teammates is just, I, it makes me speechless to think that they think of me so highly. It's just, it's a huge honor. Uh, you're a natural defender uh, who for the first time at any level stepped up to play uh, front last fall. You finished with seven goals, which was capped by netting just the third hat trick in program history in the 7-0 victory against uh, Louisiana College to close out the regular season. Talk about how you were able to make the adjustments so well and what expectations do you have for yourself this season? Um, again, a big part was my teammates. I couldn't have done it without their help and their guidance and their encouragement because I had never played that position before in my life. And so having their support was just, it was huge. And uh, this year I just hope to continue that, to play wherever coach needs me to play and you know continue to score goals. The team was selected to finish sixth in the ASC preseason poll, which is where it finished last season. How much stock is everybody putting in into the preseason rankings and what goals have the players set for the upcoming season? Um, ourselves as a team, we don't really care where people put us. We know that we belong at the top and that's what we set out to prove this season. We just want to prove that you know we are here to compete. We have a bunch of new people. We're working really hard and you know we want to win. The non-conference schedule will be tough with three of the four matches against winning teams from last season and it kicks off Thursday night against Trinity, which is ranked 10th nationally. What is the mindset going into the opener? Um, we're really excited. We play Harden Simmons um, every year, and they're ranked number one. So we, we're we really taking this as an opportunity to show what we can do with all the new talent we have and all the great team chemistry we have. We're just really excited to show everybody that we, we can do it. All right. Thanks a lot, Amanda. Good luck. Thanks.